Redbox is no longer renting video games! Yeah! Now why is this good news, and why should you care? Since Redbox no longer wants to rent out video games, they want to get rid of them! And they're selling these games for decent discounts. I basically only play first party Nintendo games, and there's a decent amount here for sale. And I'm not gonna tell you guys which ones I'm getting, or the price, until we get to the red boxes that are selling them. So, let's go! I was literally just laying in bed and that tweet came up, and this is just a spur of the moment video. First stop, the Logan Paul merch shop. And there's the red box. How the hell am I supposed to keep this open and buy stuff? Ugh. And there's the first one, Super Mario Maker 2 for $35. Ugh. There we go, Super Mario Maker 2. Normally $60, $35. I'll be honest, I'm not that big of a fan of Mario Maker games because of the reasons in this tweet, but since it's discounted almost half off, then I can deal with it. And I know it doesn't come with a normal Nintendo Switch game case, but eh. Again, I paid way less than it would normally be. Maybe if Redbox goes out of business, this case would be a pretty cool keepsake, like when Blockbuster went out of business. Going off of loose price, it's about $41, so I saved like $6. To the next red box! Second stop, Safeway. And this red box is indoors. And there's nothing more pleasant than seeing a YouTuber vlog inside a store. And by that, I mean it makes everyone want to die on the inside. New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe for $30. Take the 69 Reasons Why tape. And... New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. I 100% of this game on the Wii U version, but I never played Super Luigi U, so now's my chance. Saved about $7.50. On to the third location. Destination is on the right. Circle K! This isn't in a great part of town, so I better hurry. <laughs> Another one of these stupid mm, Yoshi's Crafted World for $17.99. Oh my god. Uh, uh. Ooh, this one is modern. Yoshi's Crafted World. Yep, this is the best deal. $17.99. Loose price, $38.50. Saved about... math. But yeah, this one's the best so far. And there's one more game I'm looking to buy. Mario Tennis Aces. And the closest machine is 40 miles away in a different city. $24.99. Do I really want to drive an hour to save $10? Yes. Let's go. But first, I gotta go to Best Buy, cause I wanna pick up something before they close. I was gonna pick up this item on Black Friday, but I didn't. Don't worry, it's video game related, so it goes in this video. Ooh, a quarter. <laughs> yes! The last Starlink for $10. Oh wait. Yeah, this game is so trash that they're keeping the Black Friday price way after Black Friday. And they still have this. The only reason I want another copy is because I destroyed the game case for a video, and yeah, I want another copy of that. Ugh. Get in there, trash. Okay, now let's waste my time, cause my time is not valuable. Don't you hate it when your car crashes while you're backing out? I wonder if I should have told my mom I was heading out of town in the middle of the night, randomly, for a $10 discount on a game. What should I do for the next 40 minutes? We're halfway there. 
four minutes away and we're about to head into the town. Ooh, a ghost town. Creepy. Ooh, the street is Jacksepticeye Street. Creepy. And there it is, the Dollar General. Ooh, the length I go for dumb stuff. Now, let's hurry up and get out of here. Not on this page. And it's the only one on the last page. Yes, check out. Hey now. Ooh, ooh. Once again, hurry up, take the 69 reasons why. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Good. Anyone in here? Let's go, let's go, let's go. You serious? Okay, okay. <laughs> and the car crashed while trying to open the door for me. Yeah, that's a new horror movie premise. The car door won't open because the car's software crashed. What if I open this and it's one of the scams people try where they print off a picture of the cartridge and Redbox accepts it? Oh. Okay, good. It's the Switch game. Loose $34. Yep, saved like $10, and all I had to do was risk getting murdered by a serial killer out in the middle of nowhere. And that completes the red box collection I wanted. Thank you, Rimrock, Arizona, a town I've never been to before. Still can't get over the fact I drove an hour for a dollar store. This isn't even my final stop. Let's head back to Flagstaff. If you live in this town, I'm sorry for calling it creepy, but it is. Picking up one more thing. I also should have bought this thing on Black Friday, but I didn't. I forgot about it for some reason. Nearly midnight. Thank God for 24 hour Walmarts. Oops. Okay. <laughs> That's not gonna fit 50% of their clientele. Ooh, they have a red blue box here. And it's only movies. Sorry, I just had to buy some stuff for my family first. But there's what I'm looking for. Where's a Walmart employee? I need my Just Dance 2020. No one's coming. Fine, I'll find one myself. Just Dance 2020, please. Thank you. So, why Just Dance 2020? Because apparently, it's the last Wii game that's ever going to be released. And I want a part of that history. On Black Friday, it was $20. But right now, I had to pay $33.88. Ugh, no saving money. I guess all the money I saved buying those Switch games is going towards Just Dance 2020. Alright, let's go home. Actually, one more thing I have to go to. Oh yeah, if you've seen this, this isn't blood, it's red ink that I wanted to look like blood for a video, okay? We're back at the Logan Paul merch store, cause I forgot to take a thumbnail shot down in that town I can't remember the name of. Okay, got the thumbnail shot. Oh, it's cold. And my car is yelling at me to go home. Okay, okay, I will this time. Oh yeah, I forgot to give my opinion on these two games. This one I really want to play. I played the demo and it seems really fun. And getting it for $17.99, that just seals the deal. And Mario Tennis Aces? Meh. I played it at a friend's house and it was... Alright, I don't think I'm gonna play it. And I'm not a big fan of tennis games anyway. I only bought it because it had Mario in the title. You know how Apple Sheep only buy Apple products because of the Apple logo? Well, that's the same with Nintendo fanboys and Mario. Hmm, what am I gonna do with this one now that I have a brand new one? Make sure all these work. That one works. Can I get points? Yes! Points! That one works. Points! That one works. Points! And finally, this one. Uh-oh. <sighs> Okay, 
Almost gave me a heart attack since that was the one I drove an hour for. Points. Of course. So with the cards that I got points from, I think I saved another $1.80. Yeah. Before I end the video, I just want to mention that Smash Bros is 50% off. I saw it multiple times at multiple kiosks, but I didn't buy it because I already have three copies of it. Don't ask. You can get that or Sports Party. And Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu is $20, but I don't care about Pokemon. So yeah, shout out to Redbox for deciding not to rent out video games and selling these at a pretty good discount. But what do you guys think? Did I get a good deal or not? Were they worth it? Comment down below. And so with that, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. They're gonna look real good on my game shelf, along with Just Dance 2020. Starlink can go in the closet for all I care. Oh yeah, my quarter.